So when people are choosing an everyday Bible to read, uh, there's a few considerations that they should have, and, and one of them is just how good a reader they are, really. I mean, you know, how, <laughs> yeah. how, how much are you a reader? Some people are just better readers, man. They just read a lot. And if you're not mm. that good a reader, then you would need to look towards the end of something that's just simple to read. Uh, those who love digging deep into meaning and, and history and, and they like words, you know, then yeah. th- they'd prefer a word-for-word type of variety. And, uh, yeah, so that's where you need to ask others for advice, people who know you. Do a bit of research, but at the end of the day, the best Bible translation to have is the one you're going to read, mate. It's yeah, the one true. you're going to read, you know. Get which is the best Bible? Well, it's the one you're going to read. Okay, get that one. So, um, so yeah, 